So this is Annie, she's with the Horse and Rider on Demand team and she's primarily has an English background and she's coming over here to the Western and she just bought this new Western horse. Uh, he's greener and a little bit novice in these classes. And we're just gonna show you how we would introduce him to some of these side pass uh, maneuvers and trail maneuvers as well as some of the reining later. So to start with, I'm gonna have Annie just kinda come over here. She's gonna straddle the pole let him settle, make sure he's comfortable. And then I'm gonna ask her just to start side passing off. So there, she's got her right leg on him. She's just pushing him over. There you go. And you'll notice that a lot of these horses, when they side pass, they don't just stay perfectly lateral. They'll migrate forward or they'll migrate back. And he migrated forward, which is a pretty common problem. And so as she went, you saw her kind of maintain him with her hand to sort of keep him from just walking all the way off of that pole. But he has a pretty good understanding of lateral work. And so he did that pretty well. So now let's take him over and we're just gonna go beside the pole and we're gonna side pass onto the pole. So she walks up, I want her to stop where that pole is right behind her heel. And then she's just gonna ask him to side pass over with her left leg, one or two steps, and then just kind of stand there. Good. I mean, it's really important that when we're teaching these horses to do any of these maneuvers, that we just do one or two, three steps, and we let them stop, and we let them settle, and we let them relax. We don't wanna just keep the pressure on them. All right, now let's ask him to step over a couple more steps. Good, so you see she's kind of having to manage him a little bit. He's wanting to walk forward and she's just kind of pulling on his mouth just a little and kind of rocked him back and just said, no, I don't need you back there. All right, so now let's go ahead. It's going pretty good. All right, so no problem. So we backed up, she just walked him back forward. Let's say that he backed all the way off of that pole. There's no problem to just walk him back around and set him back up for that again. Or if you've got a horse that walked all the way forward and they have their back feet over the pole. So let's say he just walked too far forward on you. And then, well, you're just gonna need to abort the mission and walk him back around and start again. You know, don't ever try to back those horses up over that pole. I'll see people do that and I'm not sure if they're aware that the pole is behind their feet or what, but you dang sure will get those horses in a bind. So you need to to make sure that you just keep him safe. So now we'll walk him back forward, put him where we want him. Good. Now let's try moving him around that corner. So she's gonna lift her hands kind of straight up. She's gonna keep her right rein on that shoulder and that neck to stabilize it. She brought her left leg back, pushed his hips around. And then you can't really see it probably from the camera, but she did have a little bit of that right calf on him to help keep that shoulder straight. And then he did that really well for her. All right, so now you see that her back feet, or excuse me, her front feet are pretty close to that pole, which is exactly where she needed to be to make the corner of that L. But now she has to finish the maneuver. And so as she side passes to the right, she's gonna wanna step up just a little bit so she can put that pole back behind her heel so she has a little bit of margin of error so she's not ticking or hitting those poles. You gotta remember that this is a judged event and in most classes, they're gonna start taking penalties um, for hitting or ticking these poles. So we need to make sure that we set these horses up to not touch anything. Good, now just keep side passing him all the way off. Good. So that's how we do a lot of just starting these colts, just real step-by-step, -step, methodical, easy, and then we'll kind of go on.